Do you recall the tool the wielders were given in order to make them stronger? We generally don't concern ourselves with what they have at their disposal. However, I believe those tools were the nightmares doing. The bangles? I know when they're equipped, they have the power to collect dark energy. But I thought we all agreed that was okay. Collecting is fine. But using that power is the equivalent of using the power of darkness. It's a brilliant plan. Everyone knows that all spirits look the same, and wielders exist in spades. There's no way to tell. Oh no. Everyone's already equipped their bangles. So what now? How do we find out who's behind this? Seeing as those bangles couldn't have been acquired by just anyone, I believe it's one of us here in this room. No, Ira. I respectfully disagree. What proof do we have that the bangles are tied to the power of darkness, or if a nightmare is to blame? We shouldn't simply jump to conclusions. Ira, some leader you are, you've managed to plant seeds of doubt in all of us with that speech. What, did you expect the traitor to give themselves up with that accusation of yours? <laughs> that was foolish. I said, that's quite enough. It looks to me like the Master made the wrong choice. Wait, where do you think you're going? I think we're done here. I trust you'll keep us all updated. I hope... I hope we can all resolve this soon. That didn't go as expected. What's wrong, Ira? This isn't like you. A lost page. Something's missing from our Book of Prophecies. Each of our copies were said to contain the events of the future. But this incident... Well, it's nowhere to be found. And how does this whole thing with the traitor tie together? Like I said, it's nowhere to be found. In my book. Ira, are you implying that someone is in possession of the missing page? And the person with the complete book is the traitor? There is something going on, and the page is suspiciously missing from the book. It's not so far-fetched to assume that the one who has the lost page has been turned. That they have fallen into the hands of darkness. Trust me. There seems to be no record of it in my book either. You may be onto something. I wonder, could this have been the Master's plan all along? To grant the lost page to only one of us? We have no way of knowing. The Master is gone. I understand what you are saying. I promise to keep a close eye on the others. I will keep you informed, as always. Thanks. Of course. After all, that is what the Master asked of me. And Ira, may your heart be your guiding key. So, to sum it up, I'll need you to observe the others. Easy breezy. Uh, all right. Hmm. Like I said, Ira may have to take over for me. But don't be shy. Just be fair. Then do not be afraid to speak up. Even though I say observe, you'll need to be the mediator. Make sure people get along. I understand. But, without you or Lushu, to form and maintain our own unions is... It's a little unnerving, to be honest. Oh, come on! Lighten up a little. Maybe I'll never disappear. Wait, do you want 
me to go? What? N no, of course not. <laughs> I was just kidding. Oh, I see. Look, I, I get that change can be hard for everyone, but things need to keep moving forward. And you need to keep up. Otherwise, you'll just get left behind all alone. Now that you know what the future holds, Envy, what does your heart say? <laughs> May your heart be your guiding key. I say it all the time. You ultimately need to do what your heart feels is right. Right. I was wrong about Ira. I thought he would make a great leader, but he let me down. Well, what do you two think? You don't believe what Ira said, do you? Of course not. His argument was unconvincing. It's like Inby said. He's just making baseless assumptions given the situation. There's no evidence to tie his accusations to anyone, let alone one of us. <sighs> Maybe... There's something he hasn't told us. And he needs to tell us! How dare he look at us with suspicion! We're his comrades! I wouldn't call us comrades. Anyway, could you get to the point? I know you didn't call us here just to complain. I want the three of us to form an alliance. But alliances are forbidden, I said. I knew it. I had a feeling it would come to this. So, we join forces, then confront Ira? Confronting him is pointless. Ira won't change his mind. I know there's darkness at work. There's no question. But, I don't believe for a second there's a traitor among us. Unfortunately, Ira doesn't share the same belief. He's just wasting time trying to figure out who the traitor is. But darkness won't wait, and neither should we. We need to band together now, and find a way to fight it! Hmm. Guess it makes sense. I agree that we need to do something to fight the darkness. But combining our unions? That was strictly forbidden by the Master. He's no longer here. I'm in. But let's be clear. The Alliance is just between the two of us right now. I don't want my union members involved. Gula! I want... I want to follow the Master's teachings. Understood. That's your choice to make. You should do whatever you feel is right. Yeah. By the way, said, do Ira and Inby know? I haven't talked to Ira about it for obvious reasons, but I did ask Envy to join us. You wanted to see me? Uh, Gula, Ava, what are you doing here? What's the meaning of this? Hear me out, Envy. I want an alliance among our unions. Gula here has already agreed. Will you join us, and together we and can- And disobey the Master's teachings? We don't have a choice! Darkness is approaching, and we need to combine our strength to stand against it. The Master bestowed each of us with a different role, and he specifically told us to keep our union separate, to maintain the balance of power. He told us that any imbalance would lead to a desire for more power, which leads to darkness. I know you haven't forgotten. Perhaps... it's you who has been tainted by darkness. I'm tainted by darkness? Then what about you, Envy? You spy on us and report everything you see back to Ira. You really think you have no darkness in your heart after what you did? Because that is my role. To observe us, yes. But not to disclose everything we say and do to Ira. That's... For all we know, you and Ira could be allies, scheming behind our backs. That's enough.
When will it stop? I don't want us to turn against each other. Master Alva! <gasps> oh, hello. Your name is Ephemer, right? Uh-huh. Uh, hey, can I join you? Uh-huh. Why the long face? Did something happen? Hmm. Long day. Do you remember what you asked me before? About why the unions compete against each other instead of working together? Actually, I always wondered the same thing. Huh? Isn't it just because the Master said so? Yes. And as such, we must obey. The Master said so. So it is. But lately... I've really started to wonder. You once told me that you were looking for answers. That you wanted to solve the mysteries of this world. Well... I think that's how things should be. We need to question things and... think for ourselves. Whoa! You are really not yourself today. I guess even foretellers have their off days. Hey, maybe talking about the book will cheer you up. Not a chance. Aww. Hm. You were trying to pull a fast one on me, weren't you? Oh, no, no, I was joking. If you say so. But to be honest, I think it would be great if all the unions could work together and be friends. You know, I made a friend from another union today. Wasn't much of a talker, maybe just shy. We're meeting again tomorrow. That sounds like so much fun. Then you'd better go home and get some sleep. Okay. Well, it was nice talking to you. I don't know what's got you down, but please cheer up. Thank you. If the worst happens, I'll be glad to leave the future to the kids who see the world in the way that you do. Let the wind carry you far, far away. My dandelions. Envy. Have you learned something? It seems Ased and Gula's unions are now allied. So Ased is the traitor after all. No. I don't believe he is. Why is that? To Ased? Unification is a means of gathering strength to oppose the darkness. So I believe his heart still belongs to the light. Even so, forming alliances was strictly forbidden by the Master. Yes, and his teachings are absolute. That's why I will try and persuade Gula to dissolve their alliance. Then I'll do it. No. Please, let me do the talking. Your intervention will do nothing more than spur Ased's anger. All right. I'll leave it to you. And one more thing. Ased has begun to question the two of us. As a precaution, my reports will be less frequent. I don't want him to get the wrong idea. Please understand. Yes, I do. I think I'm done. Done with what? <laughs> the Alliance. I think it's time to call it quits. For what reason? To put it simply, I entered this Alliance thinking we were preparing to fight some impending darkness, but it hasn't come. In fact, there haven't been any suspicious incidents recently, and you haven't rallied anyone else to your cause. 
Yeah, but... <sighs> this alliance is meaningless. Even Envy agrees. Oh! Envy? Uh-oh. You weren't supposed to find out. Is Envy the one who told you to break our alliance? Maybe, but I'm the one who decided to do it, and I've already told you why. But we don't even know who the traitor is yet! <laughs> and that's exactly why. I just can't trust anyone but myself. Don't you realize you won't stand a chance against the darkness on your own? Sorry, my mind's made up. Envy, you will regret this. <laughs> 